Hi, do you have Thrive Themes Architect, the visual drag and drop editor for editing your posts and pages in WordPress? And have you had any problems launching it like this? When you launch it, it never gets out of this um, loading page. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this. Welcome to SharingYourPassion.com. I'm Chill, and my goal is to help you transform your passions into an online business. I will assist you with creating WordPress websites, online courses, email automation, membership sites, social media and how to make it work for you, sales and marketing, and more. Basically, you provide the passion and I provide assistance, and let's work to get your dream realized. Subscribe and click the notification bell to set your dreams in motion. Okay, we might as well kill this page. Yesterday, December 11, there was um, there was a set of Thrive updates. Whenever Thrive has an update, all, all of its products are usually needing updates at the same time. So I updated Thrive Apprentice, Architect, Leads, and Quiz Builder yesterday. And after I upgraded Thrive's uh, plugins, I couldn't get Thrive Architect to work. Whenever I tried um, opening up a post or opening up a page, and editing it with architect it always got stuck in that loading page and so what i did was log into my thrive account and i posted this note that i was having a problem with that you know uh, loading green dots page and uh, ex explained my situation using windows 10 with the chrome browser but it also didn't work on firefox Christian got back to me and said, we'll need your admin access. Like, uh-oh, <laughs> never shared my admin access to anybody. But of course I trust the Thrive people. It's just that I felt like the error was going to be widespread. So I did not want to just create this temporary admin for, for the Thrive support people. I just wanted to wait another day to see how this shakes out and see how other people fix the problem. So yeah, normally if you have a problem, the Thrive support will need admin access. And it's kind of scary to provide you know others with admin access because they'll try to recreate your problem and they'll also turn off certain things like different plugins that might conflict with the Thrive plugins. And I feel just a little uncomfortable with that because my site is in production and I can't afford to have, you know, um, somebody else tinker with it, maybe break it and maybe not know how to fix it again. Um, so I waited and today this morning I, I found an interesting note. Somebody was having the same problems. They updated to yesterday's uh, Thrive Architect version 2.4.6 and they've had that green balls just bounce around endlessly problem so the support people went into his account with admin access and it's the same person christian figured it out it's when he deactivated jetpack which is a plugin which is pretty widespread because when you start your wordpress account half the time it comes with this jetpack plugin um, already pre-installed or ready to go and especially if you're hosting in bluehost that's why i found out about jetpack it came with the, the WordPress install I had. I use it for my sitemaps and I also use it for um, helping my images load faster because they have a cache network. Um, and it has a ton of other features which, which one of them was um, conflicting with Thrive Architect. So Christian here um, deactivated Jetpack and Thrive Architect started working with this customer again. But you know what, I did not want to just deactivate the whole entire Jetpack because I do use it for speeding up my images loading and also um, sitemaps and some other things that I don't even know about. Jetpack has maybe, I don't know, 10 to 30 different functions. It also blocks malicious attacks on your site. It's pretty useful, I, I'd, I'd like to keep it. So I, I went about turning various um, features off. You just click Jetpack and then you go to settings or you can go through settings over here, Jetpack settings. And then go to sharing. And I think I've found and isolated the problem. It's this sharing buttons. 
add sharing buttons so visitors can share your posts and pages on social media with a couple of quick clicks. So once I deactivated this and reloaded to just make sure that that is deactivated, just that one piece, I didn't have to deactivate this. And then now when I go back to any of my posts, pick this one, green screen, and let's launch Thrive Architect. Remember, this is where it would get stuck. And look, it loads. So yes, that's the problem. In Jetpack, for sharing buttons under sharing and settings, go to settings, sharing, and deactivate sharing buttons so that the conflict with Thrive Architect no longer exists. And you just lose the sharing button thing. And I'm sure you can find other plugins to, to do that for you and not use Jetpack. So, that's the fix. It was very concerning when this was happening because what if there was a big special event happening today and I needed to make changes and I couldn't with Thrive Architect. I just hope the Thrive people and the Jetpack people figure this out. In the future, there's no other additional conflicting uh, plugins or features because a lot of people use Jetpack and a lot of people are using Thrive Architect. I hope that solves your problem for the never ending a uh, loading page for Thrive Architect. I hope you found this useful and if so, please give the video a like. Let me know down in the comment section below if you have other questions that I haven't addressed and I'll certainly get back to you as soon as I can. I'll be doing more videos like this so subscribe and click the notification bell to see those. And remember, it's my mission to give you the tools and inspiration to help you build your online business and transform your passion into success. Thank you.